Because I wanted to get on here and do a general card reading for you. I've been really busy here, so I'm going to try to do this reading for you. So the first card that came out was the fox. So you're this fox and <laughs> you're this beautiful fox, you're foxy, you know? And you have this masculine that is on fire for you or you know, you, he's horny, like his, <laughs> he's on fire. He wants you because you're a fox and he knows this. He knows that you're a fox and I feel that for a while, you guys have been in like separation and you haven't been speaking, but he's been watching you on social media because you're the fox <laughs> and he wants to come in and swoop you off your feet. And you also got the wise owl, which is representing you being the wise owl. You, this time you're, you've wised up. You've taken everything that you and this masculine have went through and you took some time for yourself and you became wise with your decisions. Let me get more into this. So yeah, this, you got this masculine. He is, he's on fire for you right now because you're the fox. You're this beautiful fox and he knows it. And this time, you've, you've had this time to sit back and think about everything. And you've wised up. You've wised up. You're beautiful over the time that you've been in silence. Sometimes God puts us through periods of silence so we can figure out who we are. Take time for ourselves. Sometimes that's all we need. We just need time for ourselves to recharge. Because things can get messy when you have other people in your energy. Especially if two people love each other. And they come at each other at the wrong time in life. That doesn't mean that the love was fake or that that person wasn't real, that they didn't love you or you didn't love them. It was just not the right time. Spirit's telling you to take time to reflect, like I was saying. You need to take time and reflect and reflect on that. You got to take time and reflect on is it. Do you want, do you want this masculine? Do you... Spirit's asking you to take time and reflect on that relationship. Don't just rush back into it. Maybe be friends. Or maybe have a conversation. I feel like this person's coming in to have a conversation with you. But Spirit's telling you, you know, maybe after this conversation, just don't rush into anything. Just take time and reflect. Reflect on everything that's said. So this one says, take care of your needs. So you need to take care of your needs first. And once you start taking care of your needs, that's when you attract your twin flame. That's when your twin flame comes towards you. When you're focusing on yourself and you're becoming this beautiful fox and you're getting out of the negative because you've wised up. You've wised up since then. You're not, you're not gonna rush back into this. No way. You're going to take time to reflect. And you need to take care of your needs first. Let me get one more card. This one says, lady, enjoy growth and reap rewards. So you need to enjoy the growth. But you've took, you've, you need to take time and reflect. Take care of your needs. And then you will enjoy the growth. And you will reap your rewards. So sit back and... Focus on yourself right now because this masculine's not going anywhere. <laughs> he loves you and he's he's on fire for you. He's waiting for you. He's watching you from a distance. Let me get some more into this reading. Alright, beautiful souls. You got the uncertainty card. So right now, after this conversation that your masculine's gonna come in and have with you, I feel like you're still I feel like you're still uncertain and you're not sure whether you should trust this this person again. That's better, you can see that. But you're not sure that you should trust this person because of all the things that you guys went through and it was just, you guys were with each other at the wrong time in life, in the timeline. You also got the hummingbird spirit, which says joy. So I feel like you need, you also got retreat. 
it's telling you that you need a retreat. You like need to take a vacation. You need to enjoy yourself. Like you need a retreat and you need to focus on you. This is what this whole reading is about is to take time to reflect on yourself and take care of yourself. Sometimes we got to retreat from the world so we can figure ourselves out for a minute. But out of all of that, that's you're going to come out with joy. You don't have to worry. You don't have to stress so much about what the future holds because if you're going to take time to focus on yourself, you're going to enjoy that growth and you're going to reap those rewards. It's all going to come out because you, you've wised up, you know, you're not, it's not going to be the same with this masculine. I feel like you guys are really good friends and he thinks you're like so beautiful and that you're this fox and your energy is just my magnetic and he cannot stay away from you let me get some more cards here <clears throat> i'm not sure where you guys are at but i'm here in west virginia and it's it's so hot it's been hot for the last like week and this week is supposed to be even hotter i had to help my father out with his dog up there and I've just been so busy here lately. I recently had my vehicle blew up, my engine. So it's been it's been one thing after the other. So I've kind of had to retreat myself and take time and rest, which isn't a bad thing. It's like all these cards that came out is talking about retreat, take time to rest, take time to focus on you. So this card that came out says, gifts from God. We angels bring you gifts from your creator. Open your arms to receive. So the creator, so the spirit is bringing you these gifts. And the creator wants you to take this time and rest and focus on you. And the spirit wants you to receive the gifts that they have given you over this time of retreating. Don't just use this time that you're retreating in silence and resting. Don't just use this time to like drink or smoke or be doing, you know, watching websites. You need to focus on spirit right now. You need to focus on yourself. You need to put this time into, you need to take this time and do good things with it because if not, you're not going, it's not going to go well. Just don't, I know sometimes when we're like in silence and we're alone, it gets really depressing and that's why you've got to pick up like a, a hobby. If you like art, do some art. If you like going to the gym, go to the gym. If you like just taking a walk, take a walk, you know, just don't drown in your silence. This time is precious. Like, this is a gift from the creator. This is a gift from spirit allowing you to see these things in silence. Because when you have a lot of energy around you, there's no way that you can focus on yourself because you're dealing with a lot of other things. So this last card that came out says peace. Peace comes from remembering that only love is real. That's right. That's absolutely right. Once you learn that love is only love is real, then you're going to have peace in your life. I love you guys so much, and I hope God blesses you in all ways. And after this reading, I just want you to, like, maybe take some time and get a journal out. I'm not a big journaler. I just come on here and talk. <laughs> but if you like to write, take this time and write down, like, maybe what are you going to gain out of this time that you've retreated? And... What are, you, what are you gonna do? What do you wanna gain out of this? Like write down steps into your goals and what it's gonna take to overcome these challenges and these steps. But I love you guys and I hope you have a great summer. See you next time.